See you drinking on the rocks, baby And there ain't no sign of stopping, baby And there ain't no time for talking, baby Yo, what's up everybody? It's been a hot minute. Had to dust off the camera for this one. We've been in this fucking pandemic quarantine shit for about two months now. I mean, I still been working pretty much, but I haven't vlogged in a while. So I actually got to upload one vlog before this. So I'll upload that and then we're going to do this. Today's vlog is going to be about Christopher's car again. We're going to be installing some parts, some pretty pricey parts. If you guys are familiar with, with it, but we'll show you in a bit. All right, baby, this is the before. How you feeling, Christopher? <laughs> We're only gonna be doing the fronts today, though, but we'll see. Hopefully, it goes smooth. It's gonna be a lot of trial and error, I think, on this. All right, let's go check out the parts. So we're gonna be doing a short knuckle and upper control arm install, and this Christopher right here. This is what we got right here, baby. T. Looks like we got a Japanese dialogue going on over here. We got, got some long. Japanese anime right there. <laughs> Yeah. That's the RCA, huh? Yeah. I'm trying to figure out what each hardware is for. Fuck. I don't know, maybe, I guess this one is all Holy for this. Shit, that's huge. Oh, that's the bottom bolt. This is like a 22, I think. And then these are either for RC? the control arm or the knuckle. And then this is like washer. Spacer. Yeah, baby. That BB. Custom color. I don't know why everybody always sticks with oh. orange. I'm out for the custom color, baby. Damn, Fucking that looks nice. Damn. Let me see. It's over. It's fucking over, baby. Fucking, fucking, you're already spending the money. Might as well fucking get custom color. Oh! So this is gonna fucking create some camera, baby, and it's gonna make it sit lower. So this is the before I showed you. Well, uh, depending on how low the frame can go, but fuck, I think I'm bottom out already. It's over. Yeah. yeah. Some fucking nice Holy color. shit. Hopefully this doesn't affect the bearing, but Cause it's gonna be tight getting it in, but Fuck. Fucking. It's fucking. Damn, got the fucking Peter Man on the top. Oh shit. <laughs> Mine doesn't even have this. It's all fuck. Yeah. Finally with that today, hopefully it goes all smooth. Damn, you always try to make me look like that was the <laughs> You know, we always gotta get some something to drink. Today's my Friday. It's actually a Monday. My schedule changed, but I mean, we haven't really been doing much because of this quarantine shit. Just going to work, staying home. Fuck, we ain't got shit to do. Can't do shit anyways, but it's been a while since we worked on cars, but it's been a while since I made a vlog, but here we go. My hair is like all grown out, but can't even cut a hair. It's gonna be a fun one. Christian should be on his way down, so I'm gonna document this whole install. Hopefully, hopefully it goes all smooth. Yeah. All right, first things first, gotta loosen up the lug nuts. Don't want to scratch the rim, so we ain't using the gun yet. If you guys don't want to scratch the rims, grab the ones with the plastic covering. Insulation oh. sockets on Amazon for like 20 bucks for like three of them. That's the one, baby. Quick rundown. We gotta, we're changing the upper control arm, installing RCA short knuckle. Um, we might have to trim the fender liner inside, but then we gotta adjust the camber. Depending on how much he wants to run, probably get about negative eight at most with this setup. If you want more, you gotta get lowers. Yeah, we'll see. I right, got a new unboxing over here. <laughs> Some brand new jack stands from Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> Always safety tip, put a wheel under your fucking car. Just like that. You don't want the car falling down on you. That's like the worst thing that could happen. So always take precautions when it comes to safety. You know what I'm saying? CP put in work, baby. It's about to be a long night. It's about six o'clock right now. And we'll get it popping. We may have to cut this fender liner, like right here. This is what we're changing, this is what we're changing. Fucking bags, baby. All right, we gotta take out all this fucking wiring. Fuck. Then we gotta take out the brakes. Yeah, baby. And we gonna get in there. It's the number one tool right here. Damn, this thing is stuck. All right, everyone. We've been in quarantine, shout out TJ's hairline in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got the brakes off. Now we're about to take out this fucking um, hub. Sometimes fucking people have a hard time taking this shit out, so hopefully it's not gonna give us a hard time, but That's pretty simple. Damn, I don't know, we'll see. 
They have a slide hammer and you just fucking pop it out like that, but yeah. fuck, I don't have. We just gave it a little bit of hammer, put some pen training on. Good to go. We need this for the other one though. Next, we're gonna take out this upper. Try straighten the wheel now. Okay. And then we're gonna take out this fucking ball joint, baby. Yeah. J Vlogs, highlight your boy. Uh. This shit out, guys. But this is my shirt to knuckle. And that's the comparison right there. It's different cars, but let me show you guys what they do. They shorten the knuckle and they push it either this way or that way to add camber. You gotta take this into consideration when doing wheel fitment or else your fucking knuckle will touch your wheel right here. See that? And you're gonna be fucked. Then you gotta run spacers. In Christopher's case, he just went with short so he should be able to clear like this. See that? It's over. Yeah, baby. Yo, we just saw your Domino's and he passed by. Fucking, he gypped us. Yeah, so we gotta take out, probably gotta take out the shock. That way we can torque out, torque the fucking bolt. We got the pizza. Oh, we got, we got the, the temper proof seal. What temper proof seal? Yeah, this. Pepperoni. The peps. Damn, we put a lot of chicken. Damn, shout out uh, Domino's, uh, sponsor us. Oh. Yeah, we always getting pizza from you guys. Fuck, it's about time you guys sponsor. <laughs> All right, we got the row center adapters, RCAs. It goes on the bottom of the knuckle. Whatever you cut up here, you gotta replace it on the bottom over here. So it goes like this. Yeah, baby. This one doesn't have the camera ones though and the caster corrective ones because the control arm on the lower has that shit. All right, let's go to see what this looks like on the car. All right, guys, we're starting to reinstall this thing. Just get the knuckle in, snug it up a little bit. Then we gotta do the upper control arm. One thing at a time, you know what I'm saying? It's good to have NICs. Makes your life a lot easier later on. Here we go, baby. Give us some background on yourself. Background? Viewers. Um, so uh, I was born and raised in Wahoo, baby. Oh! You single, ladies? Uh, Damn. Damn, fucking Wahoo long, General. Oh, how long have you been waiting for this kit? Fucking three months, I think, already. For real? About two months. Two months. I ordered it like maybe February? February, April. So, up to you, man. If you guys like one quicker shipment process, hit us up. <laughs> the fuck? Oh. Alright, can you give us a quick tour review? We're using the Matco um, battery ratchet cordless. It's good for all your needs. Make work a lot faster, baby. Yeah, baby. Yo, what's up? CM is here. Hey, Go over there. I'm Who's our see. next sponsor for today? Who's our next sponsor? Oh, yeah, baby. Come on, show us. Grab it, grab it. Grab it, grab it, baby. Oh. Got the upper control hey, arm in. Now we're gonna slap everything back together. Hopefully, this camber fucking is good, but we'll see. Look at that clearance though. Fuck, that thing is kind of close. Alright, we're gonna check the clearance now with the bag. Because this thing is cambered all the way in right now. And we don't know how much camber we're gonna get. But we're gonna jack this bitch up and check it out. Clearance, baby. I see. I think it's cleared. Try keep going. Yeah, it's clear. Keep going then. All the way up. Come on, so we can see the camera. Okay, let's throw the wheel. Oh. Yeah, you gotta put the spacer on. That way you know the true offset. Oh. Yeah, baby. All right, though. How's that fucking day coming at? Yeah. Damn. Damn, baby. Yeah, that's thing fucking like the real right? It's over. Hey, this is a mock test head. Everything clear, so we might leave it like this. Um, see how much degrees of camber we got. Negative eight, baby. Yes, sir. She. That's good for now, but we'll be in double digits sooner or later, boys. Oh! We ran into some clearance issues on the bag. There's a lot of things you gotta take into consideration, or else you're gonna be in a lot of pain down the road. Especially when you fucking leave your camera on manual focus, like I was doing this whole time. So I don't know if all that other sh all that stuff is in focus, but fuck my life. So we gotta adjust this shit now. Pretty much gotta lessen up the camber. Push the knuckle away from the bag so it clears. So once we get that settled out, then we're gonna do the other side. Usually it takes long the first time because you gotta figure shit out. Bear with us. All right guys, we got it adjusted. 
Now we're gonna button everything up so we know what to do now. The other side should go a lot faster. But now the bag clears, so we're gonna put everything back, torque everything to spec, and it should be good. All right, guys, it's about uh, nine o'clock. We finished the other side. This side should be a lot faster because we already know what to do. So, like I said, the video is probably not in focus the fucking whole time we were shooting. So that shit got me fucked up. <laughs> Christian went home a while already. He was with his girlfriend, so I, she got to work tomorrow. So yeah. Oh, his fiance. Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, yeah, we're gonna do this side. So let's get it popping. All right, guys, it's been a long one. We got everything buttoned up. Hopefully, it goes well. It's about 9:46. Pick up sticks. <laughs> We're gonna see how much more of a difference it made. We couldn't camber it out that much because like I said, the fucking bag was rubbing, so later down the road, we'll adjust it. Try to air this thing out, see how low it goes. Hopefully it doesn't disappoint. Oh, oh fuck. Pretty straightforward, simple install. Just gotta check the clearance. God damn. And you, your frame would bottom out. Oh, you couldn't go any lower. <laughs> <laughs> the front is lower now. Holy shit, that's what you call even, baby. The frame is bottomed out, though. When I hear it airing out, the fucking thing went never moved. All right, there she is, laying out even now, tucking even. Looks pretty good, to be honest. We're done. We had our issues, but we figured it out. The bracket was rubbing, the dust shield was rubbing, so we had to fucking cut some shit off. This is the final product. Alright, that's it for today's vlog, baby. Hope you guys got some learning. That's it. Peace out. Till next time. Who knows when? Once again, quarantine life. Everybody stay safe out there. Stay cool. How you feeling? Feeling good now. It's a little fucking good thing in this damn quarantine. Yep. Keep our spirits up. Peace out. J Vlogs. Out. Yes, sir. Is it me or we in love? You got a man, I think you should ditch him. I got what you want, got what you need Talking you, me and Hennessy Baby, we just need another drink Talking you, me and Hennessy I got what you want, got what you need Talking you, me and Hennessy Baby, we just need another drink Talking you, me and Hennessy Yeah, yeah, Hennessy. yeah, wait Okay, put the henny in my cup. Could we be in love or could it be the drugs or could it be the weed? Maybe all of the above. Girl got